this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ay. Ay. Down. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Janae Mickles in case you are new. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I do a quick weave for the very first time. So as you guys know, I did dye my hair red. I didn't do an official YouTube video on it, but I did post a short. So that is on my page if you guys want to see that video. But yeah, my hair is red, my hair is shorter, and, and sometimes I just want a little bit of length. So I'm going to be doing a quick weave. Like I said, my first time doing this, I've just been seeing a lot of videos lately on it and it seems pretty easy. I actually got this method I'll be doing in this video from another video that I watched. I'll have it linked down below. So yeah, when she was doing it, it just looked super easy. So I thought, why not try it out? So first off, I'm gonna be sectioning off my hair just to get those front pieces out of the way because I'm not gonna be bringing the track all the way up to my forehead. I do want it to look as natural as possible. So I'm gonna leave a little bit out on the sides. And I also plan on wearing a middle part, so I did braid that part away as well. So my foundation isn't going to be like super crisp or tight. I'm not the best braider. I just do what I can. I did about one, two, three, maybe like six braids, just going straight back. And again, nothing neat, just something to get the hair as flat as possible. Okay, so for protection, I'll be using the Bow Hole Liquid Gold. I use this for my glueless wigs, but the video I seen, she used this because she said the black bond protector. I don't even know what it's called, y'all. I mean, that's how you know I don't do this. But um, she said that takes forever to dry, and this method doesn't. I don't have a sit-down dryer at home, so I thought this product would be perfect because I already have it. So, so yeah, that's what I'm using. I just put it in my color bowl, and then I'm using my color brush to paint it on the braids, making sure not to get it on my leave out. So after the liquid gold is all the way dry from the blow dryer, I do put my two black stocking caps on, and then I take my Ebon spray in the yellow can, and I spray it all over the cap, and not getting it on my leave out. In her video, I think she used the black one, but all I had was the yellow, and I'm just using what I have because I feel like they both would work, and it did. Up until the sunrise, sometimes you get angrier, things get dangerous, can get up and get on my ride. Three years seems like forever when you sit and think about it. I put my heart out on my sleeve, but I can't live without it. So once that's completely dry, I'm ready to glue on the track. And I'll be using the 30 seconds bond glue. I know you guys have seen this. I feel like it's the only one out. Not really sure, don't quote me. But I'll be using this glue for the quick weave. And I will be using two bundles from Kendra's Boutique. I did dye this hair red. I used 7RR by either Ion or Wella. I think it was Ion from Sally's. Um, I will say, I wish I would have had three bundles because the back is... Because in the back there is a little space, so definitely next time I'll do three bundles or two and a half. But it worked for this style. So all I did was measure the track before I placed it down, put the glue on it, placed it down, and then I used a blow dryer to secure it.
So now we are almost done. I'm just gonna flat iron my leave out and you guys will see that I do add two tracks where my leave out is just to help it blend a little bit more because my hair is shorter. So I definitely want it to be seamless. This will not damage my hair. I've wore glue ones before, so I know what I'm doing. But if you don't, just be careful with the glue on your natural hair. So this is a final look. I love it. It looks super natural and it was really easy to do. Literally took no time at all. It's a week later as I'm editing this video and I still have it in my head. I plan to go at least another week or two weeks with it in depending on, you know, what other wig videos or whatever I have to do. So it definitely lasts and I will be doing this again. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see y'all in my next one. B&B, I'm a...